let us discuss a question on coordinate geometry which came in J mains 2016. So here's the question. Find the eccentricity of the hyperbola whose length of the lattice rectum is equal to 8 and the length of its conjugate axis is equal to half of the distance between its foci. So let us try to solve this problem. Now we know that 2a is equal to length of the transverse axis. and 2b is equal to length of the conjugate axis and e is equal to eccentricity of the hyperbola. Also we know that 2ae is equal to distance between the foci of the hyperbola. Now, according to the question, length of the lattice rectum is equal to 8. Now, we know that the length of the lattice rectum is equal to 2b square by a is equal to 8. Let us say this is equation number 1. Now in the question it is also mentioned that the length of the conjugate axis of the hyperbola is equal to half of the distance between its foci. So we can write that 2b that is the length of the conjugate axis and that is equal to half of the distance between its foci that is 2ae by 2. So, from here we get the eccentricity as E equal to 2B by A. So, let us say this is equation number 2. Now, from equation 1 and equation 2, we can write that from equation 1, we can write 2B square by A is equal to 2B by A into B. And now this 2B by A from equation 2 we know that it is e. So, e into b and this is equal to 8. So, from here we get the value of b and b is equal to 8 upon e. Also, we know that from equation number from equation number 2 we know that a equal to 2b by e. So, if we put the value of b in this, we will get 2 by e into 8 by e is equal to 16 by e square. Now, the eccentricity of the hyperbola is given by the relation e equal to root over 1 plus b square by a square. So, if we put the values of b and a in this relation, we will get root over 1 plus b is 8 by e. So, 64 upon e square by a is 16 by e square. So, 16 square is 256 upon e to the power 4. Now, if we simplify this, we will get E is equal to 2 upon root 3. So, this is the eccentricity of the hyperbola.